Hello everyone and welcome, welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are all having a really, really good day. If this is your first time on my channel, my name is Sebastian and I welcome you guys with open arms. I do pop culture videos every single day. So if you're looking for a new messy best friend you have found me, make sure you grab a snack, grab a drink, get comfortable and don't forget to hit that subscribe button. It helps me out a lot, you guys. Thank you so much. Um, You guys, I was running some errands and working when I posted my last video of Britney Spears' article on TMZ, where the article states that Britney Spears desperately needs help because uh, people close to her are fear that she will, you know, pass away, okay? Um, listen, I have to tell you guys that the, um, <clears throat> the amount of messages that I am getting, I am blown away because as much as I'm so grateful that I can be there for you guys and give you the latest on Britney and updates, I wish I could do more. I wish I could give you more. I wish I could, you know, know things that, you know, maybe uh, things that, you know, we don't know, right? Um, unfortunately, you know, all I know is what is being put out. Now, one of the main things that I am getting, however, is that a lot of people are really upset with Sam Asghari, her husband. Now, Sam Asghari um, in the Britney army has really never been trusted. I, for one, I will tell you, I, um, I love the idea of somebody making Britney Spears happy. You know, I love that idea. I love the idea of Britney finally being able to find, you know, her love. You know what I mean? Like that makes me very, very happy. But um, there's just something that is not connecting, if I'm being very honest. Now, Sam Asghari has been a, someone that I have... Um, defended and I have definitely spoken very, very good about him because, you know, I believe in true love. I believe that he, you know, 90% of me believes he makes Britney Spears happy, okay? But because there's so much mystery surrounding everything with Britney, because there's so much mystery surrounding um, what is what is really going on and there's so much mystery and there's so many theories and everything, Sam Asghari is somebody that I have learned to just, you know, keep an, a close eye on, right? Um, he hardly never posts things about Britney, okay? And the, never really posts a picture of Britney. Um, I want to clarify, I'm not doing this video to add on to any suspicion on Sam at all. But I'm just saying that, um, well, I guess my point is the following. I can't really speak for anyone but myself. So if I was seeing that a website was, this is a second time in, you know, some weeks that they are alluding that Britney Spears is not mentally okay and that she desperately needs help and that she's acting erratic and all of these things. I, as, as a husband, cannot stand there and watch a fucking website destroy my wife, okay? So that is the one major thing that annoys me. I understand about how the media, you can't really react to it, you can't really do that. But, you know, the next day that the Manic episode article came out, uh, Sam Asghari spoke to a TMZ paparazzi, you know? So those things are not helpful when you are trying to defend somebody. You know what I mean? Because it just does not look good. And today, uh, no, 17 hours ago, I'm sorry, he posted a video of him and Brittany in a Target uh, 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 dressing room having fun. And then today he posted, after the article came out, he posted, enjoy the day. This was six hours ago, right? He just posted like a rock and it says, enjoy the day. Um, that's the thing that annoys me the most because I'm just like, Britney Spears literally is being dragged. Her name is being butchered. And the issue is, as a human being, I don't think that you having any kind of mental health illness or any kind of mental health problems is, 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 a, is a thing to use against you. You know, I don't think that having a mental illness 
is something that you should be ashamed about, okay? I think that on the contrary, I think that it's very, um, it's a very wonderful thing when you're able to talk about your mental illness because not only are you like, you know, kind of cutting those those handcuffs that, you know, you placed on yourself and you are also able to help people that are maybe going through that and don't have, you know, the, the, the courage yet to speak out. So I just feel that Britney is always targeted from TMZ. There's always so much suspicious that, um, you know, theories and stuff that TMZ works close with Team Con. Um, it, allegedly, in my opinion, those are the rumors. And it just, it's so weird because the thing is, Sam Asghari has spoken out before. He has been vocal about things. So I don't get why he just does not, you know, stand up and say something. Go live on Instagram and say, what the fuck is wrong with you? You know, leave my wife alone, right? So that is the issue that I have with Sam, you know, that I could say. It. I can't go into deeper thing because... I, I'm not there. I don't know what is going on. But I wish that Sam would defend Britney more. Like he has in the past. He has in the past somewhat, you know, here and there. Um, so, you know, it doesn't help that he's staying silent. And then it doesn't help as well that he always is seen by paparazzi. And he is seen by, you know, all of these things. Uh, and, and he does always those walking in the parking lot interviews with the paparazzi. The same people, the same business that is, you know, saying that Britney Spears had a manic episode at a restaurant, okay? So I just wish that Sam would be more outspoken. I wish that Sam would stand up for Britney more. I wish that Sam would just, you know, defend Britney. And I get why she doesn't come out and say something like, or in a video or something. But I just think at this point... Um, there has been a, um, you know, Brittany grew up in a time where media press behavior was, uh, very important. You have to act a certain way. You have to, uh, respond a certain way. You have to stay quiet in certain situations. So Brittany is you know, doesn't it, like she's used to that, right? So maybe she's taking the quiet approach. But if nothing really is going on, and if this is all a lie, and this is just a way to, uh, you know, further, uh, you know, further the agenda that Britney Spears is not well, um, and it can be proven otherwise, then I really do wish that Sam or Britney would speak out at this point. Um, I am, you know, I've, I've been asked many times, what do you think, how, you know, what do you think? The only thing I can tell you, you guys, is that I have been very vocal on that. I don't believe that there is, um, that everything is picture perfect. You know, I, I, I do have to say, and, and, you know, I'm not a conspiracy person, but I am an honest person. I really do, in my heart, believe that something is not adding up. I don't know what it is. I, everything that's out there, I'm not saying that I agree with that either because there are some very far-fetched things in my opinion. Um, but the fact that Britney hasn't been defended yet is very alarming to me because if they stay quiet about this, they are basically allowing the general public to make up their own um, theories make up their own whatever from the articles from what the press is saying um, that is my issue and I feel that Brittany is being thrown in the mud her legacy every single day is being um, stained and I don't see how um, I don't see how this can go away without either of them speaking out, preferably Brittany herself. I I do pray that Sam is there. I hope that he is protecting his lioness like he has said in the past. I do pray that, you know, that this is not true because, you know, I was asked if I thought that this was true. Um, I don't believe that this is true, but I do believe that something is not adding up. What 
is that? I have no idea. But um, I just don't know, you guys. Like, I really don't know what to say. And I wish that I, I could tell you more. I wish that I knew more. Um, but I don't know, you guys. Uh, what do you think? Let me know in the comments. Um, if for some reason, you know, Sam is watching this, um, which, you know, it could be. Who knows? You know, um, I just tell you that sometimes staying quiet um, is good. But sometimes staying quiet is also good because it's just fueling the uh, the message and the agenda um, that this publication is, is, is having for Britney, which obviously it's to put Britney in a light that is incredibly, incredibly, um, scary. If I'm being frank, I think that having, again, a mental illness is nothing to be ashamed about. If she does, it would be so amazing, um, for her to, to talk about it. But of course, you know, I only say it as it can definitely um, uh, help a lot of people who, who might need that because if Britney Spears is coming out saying she suffers from this or that or this, I think that that will, will make a lot of people stronger and, they, and, and it will definitely help. But, um, but yeah, I don't know you guys. What do you think? Let me know in the comments. I, I am concerned, I'm not gonna lie. And it is scary. And I just pray that everything is okay. So what do you guys think? Let me know in the comments. I hope that Sam speaks out. And um, yeah, I'll see you guys in my next video. Mwah.